Welcome to another daily vlog. So I'm just about to go in to the Mandarin Oriental here in Knightsbridge um, for my first meeting. And then I'm gonna head over to Harvey Nichols to get my nails done. I just used um, these like sachets that had the remover in them on the bus. So they are very, very snazzy. They're these elegant touch ones. Really impressed. Oh, how beautiful. Um, I didn't stand here just for the flowers. Anyway, I'm getting some weird looks. So I'm gonna go into my meeting and I'll see you guys after it. off especially I was meant to arrive at 10 o'clock but I put it in my diary as half 10 so I missed it and they couldn't fit me in so I'm now taking a lovely long walk I'm gonna walk all through Hyde Park to get to Kensington uh, Roof Gardens which is where my next event is gonna set up my laptop do some work and it's actually such a nice day so I'm actually quite happy with the outcome my nails are not happy <laughs> just got to the roof gardens in Kensington where we're going to be doing a spin class on Santander bikes so Santander are the new like Boris bikes um, just got to Kensington roof gardens and there are actual flamingos here like I thought they were new plastic but they are actual flamingos look at this This place is so freaking cool! Oh my god, they are actual baby girls! They are little sausages! I'm trying my hardest. If you could all spread out and try and go with a bottle. Okay, so we've got our bikes. Are you ready for a spin, darling? Ready for a spin. So we've got all of our Santander bikes lined up. Um, I think we're just using them like normal bikes. We're going to up the gear to make it harder. So it should be a. again and I'm heading up to the fourth floor to the Hershey's salon um, and we're basically gonna get a Frank body scrub so Frank that do the coffee scrubs I'm gonna go and get their um, coffee scrub treatment I'm so excited and uh, getting all the weird looks so I'm gonna head up there. Oh my 
gosh, that was so relaxing. I literally do not want to move from this room and get back to my day. <laughs> so I've just had a full body scrub using the original Frank scrub. It's just so nice to have someone else do it for you, so relaxing. And then I had the Frank body balm massaged into me, which was lovely, trying not to flash you. Um, and it smells so good. I completely forgot how amazing it smells. It's like Play-Doh. I basically smell like a four-year-old and it's amazing. So that was fantastic. And it's available here in Harvey Nicks up on the fourth floor in Hershersons. Honestly, my skin feels so soft right now. So good for like after holidays. Obviously I've been tanning and I needed a good scrub down to give my tan a final little boost. Also be really good before holiday as well to like prep your skin. So that was amazing. I think I'm gonna go and get my hair blow dried now. While I'm here, it'd be rude not to. So I'm gonna get changed and I'll see you outside. Now I am heading to meet Charlie. We're going to an event this evening at the Me Hotel. Um, but I've just found out that I'm not going to have anything to get changed into because basically ASOS kindly said that they would send an outfit. Um, so I'm still wearing my gym kit from this morning, but the outfit hasn't arrived. So I'm going to have to go to the event wearing my gym kit. But hey ho, could be worse. Glamorous from here up and not so glamorous from here down. So I've got my camera back. Whoop whoop! Thank you for bringing it for me, darling. Look at that trainer's on. Normally I have to right down. So we're at the ME. Is it me or ME? ME Hotel. ME Hotel now. Um, for a Philips event. Philips on a care. My favourite toothbrush. There's just one actually. Oh yeah, there's one on the window. Same one as well. Larger than life. Um, I've got my chicken skewer. And there are triple cooked chips behind me, which I'm very excited about. And I think we're going to be finding out about how say, how to fall in love with your smiles so and how good teeth impact your confidence and impact your love life. So, um, please not pay attention. That view behind there is About two but it's rose gold. You know you're getting old when you get excited by it. Oh my god, it's literally the most beautiful toothbrush I've ever Even seen. Even I love it. It's so beautiful. So we're just taking a scenic walk um, across the bridge. Look, you've got what have you got? You've got some pools, cool. shard. Cheese grater, walkie talkie. No, not the shard. Shard. Walkie talkie, sky garden. Oh, and sky garden. That one that looks like the walkie talkie. That one. Uh, that's where we're going for yoga tomorrow morning. Not not Charlie, but M, who's going for a sleepover later. Walking towards Waterloo Station, Charlie's gonna head home. I'm gonna quickly go to Vicky's house because she's having a flat warming party. And then M's arriving on the train from Leeds and we're gonna have a little sleepover, but probably gonna end up having quite an early night because we've got to be at Sky Garden at 7.30 in the morning for yoga. <laughs> So 
ending the vlog last night was a bit of an epic fail. I went to Vicky's house party um, and it was really nice. It was just five of us girls, so it was less of a party and more of a nice chilled evening. And then this one came over for a sleepover, Hi. the lovely M. And right now we are on our way. Oh, I think we're here. we're here. We've just arrived at the Sky Garden and we're going to do some morning yoga. So let's Sorry. go. We're going to be doing our downward dog all the way up there. Right there. Look at her, she's so sexy. I feel so like, ah, beautiful. I feel like I need my hair, didn't I? Well, we're gonna go and get some breakfast now. We're just debating what the most Instagramable breakfast is gonna cupcake, be. Cupcake, muffin. Cupcake. We do. I don't know. I'm probably gonna get carrot cake, and then we're just gonna sit and enjoy the, oh, first. And then we're just gonna sit and enjoy this view, because it's, beach, it's stunning. Room. Look at this. again and I'm feeling really tired. I'm such a granny. I think all these like late nights, I've had about four nights in a row and I've gone to bed around midnight and they're starting to catch up with me. Um, and we're not gonna have an early night tonight either because Charlie has kindly booked tickets to go and see Suicide Squad and then we're gonna get Franco and Mike's pizza afterwards. Um, so Charlie and I have just got back from Doddle and I have quite a lot of vlogger mail. As you can see, <laughs> it's actually ridiculous, but I haven't been to Doddle in about a week, so quite a lot of stuff. And I know you guys like looking through it with me, so I'm gonna have a quick unpackage, and then, as I did last time, I will show you the highlights. So let's do some unpacking. Charlie's got some vlogger men as well, haven't you, darling? I'm not oh. gonna pan him, because he's not wearing any bloody clothing. <laughs> <laughs> And here it is, my blogger mail opened in all its glory. I don't even know where to start. I'm just gonna head up here. Um, so this is quite a surprise. I've never been sent anything by Lush before, but they've sent me this lovely parcel. It came like wrapped up in this beautiful bandana. And I seem to remember that um, when I went to a Lush event at Christmas last year, these all hand painted, what does it say? Uh, two 500 ml plastic bottles recycled to make this not wrap, which is pretty cool. And then inside, I've got a few like classic Lush items. Um, this is, oh my gosh, this is a deodorant. That is intriguing. This is a solid shampoo bar. Um, we've got a dry shampoo, a powdered sunscreen. This, I have no idea what that is. Gargle blaster. But then this is what they're really celebrating. So these four are the world's first solid mouthwash. So they're mouthwash tablets, um, I'm going to try them in a second because I'm intrigued. You basically put it in your mouth and then gargle some water and you've got mouthwash. So quite a handy thing to have in your handbag or for travelling. So very interested to try those, that's from Lush. Then Pixie, who are always just so lovely and generous, they've sent me an entire box full of multi balms. So these are new for spring summer 16 from Pixie. I'm going to try and get one out and show you. Um, this one obviously is my favourite colour, multi balm in baby petal. And it looks a little bit something like this, so I'm going to pop that lid off. And you can see it's just basically a, um, like a, like a lip balm I guess. And you can use these on your lips and on your cheeks, so really beautiful. Lots of gorgeous colours, you've got browns, you've got like lilacs, um, very kind of baby pink and some red. Um, so yeah, lots of really beautiful lip colours. 
Actually, do you know what? I really do not need all of these, so I may be generous and do a cheeky giveaway. So, I'm going to reserve this for you guys that have actually got this far into the video as a little reward. So if you are still watching, then share this vlog on your Twitter um, and just tag me somehow and do like hashtag pixie giveaway. I'll leave on the screen and I'll pick a winner. So good luck and you can win one of these lovely pixie multi bombs. Next, there was a lovely delivery from Declayor, and Declayor is a brand that always reminds me of my mum. She always used to use it, and I used to pinch it from the bathroom. And they've kindly sent me a load of things. They've got a refreshing mist. I bet this smells incredible. Anti-pollution hydrating gel cream. There seems to be so many anti-polluting products these days, but again, hydrofloral, that sounds beautiful. This, I think, is a tan accelerating oil. Very interesting. I'm intrigued to try that one. Body refining oil, instant glow for eyes, um, an exfoliator. So lots of lovely bits from Declayor. This is a cordially face mist, and I always have one of these in my handbag. absolutely love them. But this one is a special limited edition design by Jason Wu. So the bottle has been redesigned by the designer. So that's rather beautiful. Then... This is incredibly snazzy, look at this. A pair of trainers, and you guys know I'm not very cool, so I don't know how I'm gonna rock these, but I'm gonna have to practice putting some outfits together. From Lacoste, with that gold crocodile. Let me know how I should style these, because I'm just not cool enough for trainers, as you know. I've very, very generously been sent a pair of sunglasses from Miu Miu, and look how beautiful these are. Also love the Mimi packaging, all this pink and velvet. Oh, look at them, they're so stunning. I am very, very grateful. I will leave a link to where you can buy these down in the description box. They're from a company called Shade Station. In here is a pair of jeans from American Eagle, so let's have a little look. I love how they package these, they are so cute. Ow, paper cut. Here we go, dun dun dun, just a beautiful pair of like, I'm just gonna throw them on the floor so I can show you them. Beautiful pair of classic denim jeans from American Eagle um, Outfitters. They are a beautiful, lovely light denim color, so I'm gonna try those on in a little bit. Then we've got Deep Euphoria, which is a new fragrance from, I was about to say Calvin Harris, but obviously it's Calvin Klein. I love the traditional Euphoria fragrances, so I'm looking forward to trying that one. This is quite exciting. So I've been sent an invitation by ITV for a premiere of a new TV screening. So it's called Victoria and it's gonna be at Kensington Palace red carpet dress code. So I am very intrigued. This is gonna be next Thursday. Obviously I'll still be vlogging at this point so you guys will be able to come along with me. But it sounds amazing. Very, very excited for that. This is an exciting package. You guys know my love for rose gold and models own. So hello drugstore affordable makeup brushes that look amazing. Models own have sent me three of their literally stunning rose gold makeup brushes. This one is a foundation brush, a shading brush, and a hollow foundation brush. So you kind of like put your foundation in the hole in the middle. They're just absolutely beautiful. I love the packaging as well. How nice is that? Um, and the same PR company also looks after Kiko, and I just love the texture of Kiko. Uh, ooh, do you see that? That's pretty cool. Dong. <laughs> I love the texture of Kiko lipsticks. They're just very balmy, so let's see what shade I've got. Oh, it comes out there. <gasps> Look at this. Can't get it out, there we go. Beautiful kind of like plummy colour. I'll probably save that until autumn because I love that colour, but feeling a little bit more summery at the moment. This is quite exciting, so um, Lee Stafford have this absolutely stunning pink and rose gold range of heated hair appliances. You may have seen my Dyson review, I reviewed the Coco Loco hair dryer, well this is from that same range, and it's kind of like a really dodgy looking, bobbly <laughs> hair tongue. Not sure how it works, but we will give that a go. Then I have some bits from L'Oreal, they've kindly sent me some Mythic Oil Shampoo, hair mask, um, hair balm, and also, this is exciting, the Steam Pod, but the Brazil version, so obviously the Olympics is happening now, although I feel like no one is really talking about it this year, I don't know why the excitement is um, passing us by, but these are special edition 
for the Olympics, let me show you. So on the steam pod, you've got this fabulous kind of birds of paradise tropical print, which is rather beautiful. Good excuse to buy the steam pod if you haven't tried it yet. It's such a lovely product. I did a video about it, so I'll link that down below if you're interested in the steam pod. Last two things. This is a new beauty box called Tilly, and I saw this box on Instagram, and I think it's amazing. So let me just open it up and check that it is what I'm thinking of. Oh, I like the packaging. Beautiful light blue packaging. Nice pink tissue paper. A little introduction to Tilly. Oh, it's a QVC box. That's interesting. QVC.com slash Tilly. Very interesting. Ooh, it's like a little past the parcel. Let's get rid of the pink fluff. Oh, this is amazing. So, look. There's a sample of the Bare Minerals um, new serum, which I'm really intrigued to try. Then we've got a Nexus shampoo, really nice brand. They use this at Dry Bar and it's so nice. Oh wow, this is Becca, I think. Yeah, look, it's a sample of the Backlight Priming Filter. A little sample of the Vita Liberata uh, Phenomenal Tan. Nexus Conditioner. Elemis Micellar Water, so handy for travel. Look how tiny that is. Not sure what that is. Lipstick or something. This is the Alpha Liquid Gold. Ooh, I've heard about this. It's meant to be amazing. Can't remember what it is, but I've heard good things. And got, oh, that's so cute. That'll be so good for tanning your face. Little mitt from Beats Liberata. And inside that bubble wrap was a nude Essie nail varnish, so such a usable colour. I find sometimes in these like monthly boxes you get really crap colours, but that's actually really beautiful. I think that's honestly probably the best beauty box I've seen in quite a long time. Genuinely usable, very good brands, like very high quality brand products. Very impressed with uh, Tilly Beauty. And last but absolutely not least is this little mystery case. There was no branding on the envelope, so I had no idea who it's come from. But this looks like the lunchbox that we had when we did the benefit. Um, do you remember that blog event where we were up on the crane dangling above London? That was in my first ever blog, so I'm going to leave that first ever video, rather. Um, vlog <laughs> video, so I'll leave that link down below. So I think this might be from Benefit. Oh no, it's not! Ooh, intriguing! This is from, they've obviously used the same uh, lunchbox company. Oh, it's from Sasson Bell. Okay, must be like some mass produced thing that Benefit got. So what have we got here from OGX? Oh, that's so cute. So they've sent me their Sunkissed Blonde Lemon Highlights Shampoo. This is a mini one, good for traveling, coconut milk, very nice. And what have we got down here? Oh my God, I think these are those inflatable Drinks holders, that is so cute. This is a little lime, a watermelon and a pineapple. So you blow these up and you can basically use them as drink holders in the swimming pool, which is adorable. And oh my God, giant inflatable donut. That is amazing. Very generous, so thank you from, very generous, thank you OGX. And this is such a lovely shampoo if you've got blonde hair, it really kind of like highlights the blonde bits, so very flattering. Good to get that summer sun-kissed makeup look. Good to get that summer sun-kissed hair look. And now I officially feel exhausted from showing you all the blogger mail. I have been absolutely spoiled. There is so much amazing stuff here. Let's go and see what Charlie's got in his blogger mail. You ready to show us, darling? Put it all away. Put it all away. Yeah. Put yes. Okay, Put some right. Two seconds. On. Two seconds. Is there anything else? So, what have you got, darling? So, I'm quite excited about these. These are from Base, Base London, for the wedding this weekend. I look rough, don't I? I really look rough. I'm just in the gym, it's all messy. You look wonderful, um, darling. Yeah, they're pretty cool. They're yeah, very nice. quite nice with the suit that Moss Bros sent me, so I'm excited to try them. Mm. Um, I wouldn't normally wear ripped jeans, but I quite like the fact that they're a darker colour. Yeah. Because most of my jeans are this colour. So, I think they'll be probably better like later in the year. Where are they from? American Eagle, so thank you for those those guys. Favourite products from Clarins, yeah. from your guys at Clarins. Um, uh, Energy Booster, which I'm quite keen They're to try. The drops. You put them in your moisturiser. Yeah, I'm amazing. quite keen to try that. That's a new product. And then these are like probably my two favourite products. What are they? 
Um, so it's the exfoliating skin scrub. Mm -hmm. uh, well, for the face, um, but it's quite it's quite fine. So you can use that quite regularly. Yeah, that's a good one. So I it's really good. Before. I use that pretty much every morning, to be honest. Mm -hmm. And then I use this every morning, which is a moisturizer. But this is the travel yes. sized one. So it's perfect for like my travel bag. Yeah. And then um, this watch, which is really cool. So it comes with three straps. Silver, so that's the watch face. What's the company? And then you've got the silver Shore Projects, they're called. Shore Projects. I think that's they're quite cool. new. Tweed, sort of, I thought that's that would awesome. look quite nice in the autumn. And then just the standard leather one. Yeah. So, um, that you can, and you, you pick and choose what straps you want. Yeah. So, yeah, so that's pretty cool. So, yeah, awesome. not bad. Not bad. Isn't he good on camera? Do you guys think Charlie should start his own YouTube channel? What do you reckon, darling? I'm not sure. Maybe Dexter. Maybe with Dexter. Maybe yeah, a joint one. Dexter could do a YouTube channel. I reckon, um, I reckon I'd get more subscribers if it was me and Dexter together. <laughs> yes. Give this video a thumbs up if you think Charlie and Dexter should do a joint lads YouTube channel. <laughs> So that's mine and Charlie's blogger mail. As you can imagine, I now have a lot of tidying to do. We have products all over the place. Um, I need to write a blog post, I need to edit a video, schedule a video, write another blog post, edit another video. Um, so busy afternoon, so I'm going to switch off the vlog for now. And I will speak to you guys in a couple of hours, because you don't want to watch me doing boring stuff. No, you don't. So, see you later. Hello again. It is now half past five. It's about three or four hours since I last vlogged. Since which I have done a bit of work. I slept. I had a nap. Yes, I had about an hour and a half nap. As I said, I was feeling very tight high. So I had a bit of a nap. One of the definite upsides of working from home is that you can nap when you want to. Major upside being that you can kiss sex there. But anyway, so just had a cup of coffee. Um, we're about to go out. Didn't fancy brushing my teeth because I'm lazy. So I'm going to try one of the new uh, Lush. This one's called Ugai. I don't even know what that means. Um, I don't know, maybe. Oh, okay. It says a an oasis of cooling green tea and cleansing sea salt. So I'm going to give these a try. Got my glass of water. I'm a little bit nervous. I think they might be a bit gross tasting. What do you reckon, Chaz? Do you want to try one? Yeah, go on. Yeah, so let's do it together. Okay. Just one. What, so you do that and then you go up, would you? Yeah. Crunch it. Oh, oh, crap. No. Oh, oh give it to me. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I mean, my teeth feel. Teeth feel. You crunch it. You got to crunch it. You, that was not very nice. You didn't do it the right way. You got to crunch it. Oh. I'm sure the other flavours are much nicer. Uh -uh. So that was an epic fail. They weren't terribly nice, but um, I won't. Huh? Um. Nah. We can just run back if it rains. Optimistic. Living life on the edge. Yes, living life on the edge. So, yeah, I'll try a few more flavours another time when I'm feeling brave. Charlie and I are just heading down to Brixton Village now. We're going to go to Honest Burger or Franco Manca. Honest Burger. Honest Burger. Honest Burger. I think they've got a special on at the moment as well. Oh, they? I can't remember, it's got like pulled pork, I think. Yummy! And then we're going to watch Suicide Squad. Charlie, are you catching Pokemon? Yes. Who have you caught? It's my destiny joke. I know it's my destiny. I've got, I've got this really cool one, which is like fire Pokemon. Flareon. Wow. And then cool. this electrical one called Jolteon. Dork alert. Big dog. Dork alert. Big dog. I've caught it. You are rubbish. No, I mean, I've caught you got it. it. Yeah, wait. Well done, darling. <laughs> A rat. Oh, for mm. fuck's sake! It's a, it's a rat. Yeah.
really full, but really perfect, full. perfectly full. I feel like a porky pig. I feel burger quenched. Oh, I got burger sweat as well. Look, I'm going all shiny. <laughs> Again, now the film was, it was very strange actually, very weird-ish, but it was a good film, did enjoy it, even though it was kind of like, yeah, it was a bit superhero-y, a bit um, out of this world, but it was good, I did enjoy it. Um, so we're home now, and we're going to get a really early night, it's not even 9 o'clock yet, I don't know what time is it, not quite 9 o'clock. And Charlie's making me watch The Office because the film comes out for that next week. And um, yeah, so I'm being rather peer pressured into that. So I'm going to also do a face mask. I'm going to try this Decleo one that was in my little blog on my haul earlier. It's the Aurobsalu Intense Glow Face Mask, which sounds really good. It says it's for tired skin. And Charlie and I are going to a friend's wedding tomorrow, so I want to have nice skin. So yeah, the rest of this evening is just pretty much going to be pampering. So I will sign off this vlog now. Hope you enjoyed spending a couple of days with me. And stay tuned for another vlog coming very soon. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you very soon. Good night. <laughs>